Uh, my name is Dante Primo, professionally known as Primo Beats from Detroit, Michigan. It's Primo Beats, you little bitch. I've been making beats for 17 years, but I've been actively pursuing production as a career and working with artists directly for about seven or eight years. Artists I've worked with so far, uh, I mean, Rio de Young OG, Ice War Bezo, Sada Baby, uh, all the shitty boys, um, PZ, RMC Mike, I mean, I'm, I'm forgetting hundreds of names. I've worked with uh, most of the people that I want to at this point, and a huge chunk of the local scene in the Detroit and Michigan market as a whole. So a little bit of everybody, to be honest with you. Well, I started making beats uh, because back in the high school days, me and all my friends, we played in bands, playing three, four, five shows literally every week, week in, week out throughout the year. And uh, the summer of my graduation, all the bands broke up, and a couple of my homies were doing some hip hop shit. So they invited me over to check it out, and my big question was, how are you making the background music? To which my boy corrected me, he said, you mean the beats? And he said, he's making them. And he showed me Fruity Loops, and basically it just went from there. I fell in love with the program. The things I'm proud of are not necessarily monetary, or you know, the songs I have with millions of views, tens of millions of streams. The, the things that matter the most to me are being able to be impactful to the people around me, especially up and coming producers, even up and coming artists, but more so producers. Just teaching and training them, giving them confidence, and showing them that, hey, if a fucking goofball like me can do it, you can do it too. My favorite thing about producing, honestly, just right back to the fundamentals, just making beats. It's very fulfilling. It's, uh, it's interesting going from a point in my life where I'm playing one instrument to where I'm essentially being the entire orchestra, the entire band. So just creating the instrumentals themselves and connecting them with artists, it's just the most rewarding part. You know, I'm a high output producer. I make a lot of beats, so I am susceptible to burnout. So to prevent myself from really letting the burnout affect my productivity, I'll just put my energy into other areas. If I'm not having fun making beats, I'll study vocal mixing techniques, I'll look into new plugins I can get. I just divert my energy elsewhere until I get back to where I need to be. Uh, one thing that I would love to see change in the music industry is just fair representation for producers across the board and transparency in how the payouts actually work so that everybody gets paid what they deserve. Music is life, wake up, do it, go throughout the day doing it, go to sleep thinking about it, eat, sleep, breathe, and shit music 24-7. That's what music is to me. Learn the business, but don't chase the money. If you're in this fundamentally to make money, you're gonna fail, you're in it for the wrong reasons. Learn to love the craft. Find artists that gravitate towards your sound and organically create music. That's the foundation of all of this. All the money and glamour and the jewelry and all that, it boils down to people that love making music, so never lose sight of that.